Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Mr. Lawrence and in today's video I will show you how to get multiple modded outfits at once. I will show them in the same order as in the thumbnail. This time the theme is blue and I'm planning to make more outfit videos with specific color themes. So leave a like and let me know which color you would like to see next. But before we begin, check out Messi Marting. They provide multiple GTA services such as modded accounts, money and rank boosts for all platforms. They deliver fast, they are reliable and it's 100% safe. The link will be in the description below and let's get straight into the video. By doing this glitch you will lose all of your saved outfits except for one. So equip one outfit that you want to keep and delete your saved outfit. You will also need GTA 5 story mode in order to do this glitch. Now open your pause menu, go to online and swap character. Your main character on the left side has to be a male character and your second character on the right has to be a female. Create a new second female character and copy the rank from your main character. Then just load into online and make a way over to any clothing store. If they don't appear, find a new session and they will appear. I already made all the component outfits, first go to the top section. Go to tactical jackets and purchase the last one. Stay at the tops and go to gun running t-shirts, then purchase the grey woodland roll tee. Now go to the pants, go to leggings and purchase number 27. Then go to the shoes. Go to boots and purchase the blue cowboy boots number 50. Now make your way over to the accessories. Make sure that you are not wearing earrings. Then go to the gloves and equip the light woodland armor, number 32. Now save this outfit to your first outfit slot and name them like I do so you don't get confused. Now see. Then head over to the pants. Go to sport pants and purchase the first one. Now go to the tops, then to work jackets and purchase the peach camel closed field, number 38. Stay in the tops and go down to tucked t-shirts, then purchase the blue digital t-shirt, number 75. You will still have the boots and gloves equipped, so now save it to your second outfit slot. Now we will make the second blue outfit. First go to the tops. Go to leather jackets and purchase the blue JC jacket, number 52. Then go to tank tops and purchase the two tone tank. Now go to the pants, sport pants and select the spotted muscle pants. Then go to the shoes, high heel boots and purchase the deluxe midnight combat boots, number 24. Now make way over to the accessories. Go to earrings and purchase the BMW deco earrings, number 40. Make sure that you remove your gloves and then save this outfit in your third outfit slot. Now we will have to change the top. Go to Bastiers and purchase the grey Bastier. Then equip the light woodland armor gloves via your interaction menu. Now save this outfit to your next empty outfit slot. Then go back to the tops. Go to work jackets and equip number 38. Then go to tucked t-shirts and select the blue digital t-shirt. Now you can save it in your fifth outfit slot. For the next outfit first go to the scuba suits and purchase the sky blue scuba. Then go to the accessories. 
go to gloves and equip the red and grey armors. Save this outfit in slot number 6. Now go to the sport pants and select the spotted muscle pants. Then go to the top section. Go to designer hoodies and purchase number 42. Back out and open your interaction menu. Go to style and put your hood up. Then go to the shoes, boots and select the blue cowboy boots again. Now save this outfit in slot number 7. Then come over to the tops and equip the peach camo closed field work jacket. Now go to gun running t-shirts and purchase the grey digital roll T number 19. Then save it in your next empty slot. We will now make the last outfit. First equip the spotted muscle pants. Then go to the tops, leather jackets and select the blue JC jacket. Then go to tank tops and purchase the two-tone tank. Then go to the shoe section, go to high heel boots and select the deluxe midnight combat boots, number 24. Save this outfit in slot number 9. Now we only have to change the top, so go to the tops. Then scroll down to leather bomber jackets and purchase the orange dotted leather. If your jacket is open, you can close it via your interaction menu if you go to style. We will save this outfit in slot number 10. Then go back to the tops, go to work jackets and select number 38. Now go to gun running t-shirts and purchase the last one, so the blue digital t-shirt. Save this outfit in slot number 11. You should now have these outfits, feel free to pause the video to double check. Now open your interaction menu and take the easy way out to force a quick save. When you respawn, open your pause menu, go to online and start creator. Once you're in creator, create a race, then select tutorial and accept this alert. Now open your pause menu again, go to online and choose character. Now you will need to delete your second character, so your female character. From here, if you're on the next gen version of GTA, click the link in the pinned comment because there's a workaround to transfer outfits on next gen. If you're on last gen, just press circle or B to go back to story mode. When you're in story mode, go straight back to online. Once you are back in online, you will still have the outfit that you wanted to keep. Save that outfit in slot number 20. If you did everything correctly, the other outfits will also be transferred over. Now go to the biker suits and purchase the blue biker suit.
from here, you will need to bookmark the job that's linked in the pinned comments. When you bookmarked the job, you will need to restart your game so it pops up in game. You can then find it through your pass menu under bookmarked jobs and then to missions. If you can't bookmark it for some reason, your friend can bookmark it and invite you to the job. Make sure that the host changes the clothing setting to player saved outfits and then he can start. Now press right on the d-pad twice and ready up. When you load in, make your way over to your apartment. You cannot see it on the map, but you should know where it's at. Now just enter your apartment. If it doesn't let you in, blow yourself up on the blue circle and when you respawn, you can enter. Now make your way over to your wardrobe. You will now need to delete blue invis 1 and 2, then save this outfit in slot 19. Now quit the mission through your phone. When you are back in online, you won't have your outfit yet, but now you can equip it through your interaction menu. Now go back to the clothing store, go to the Gorka suits and purchase the dark blue Gorka suit. From here start the job that you bookmarked. Change the clothing to play safe outfits, invite someone and start. Now switch your outfit once to the right and ready up. When you load in, go to your apartment and then go to the wardrobe. Now go to the accessories, then to gloves and select the race suit gloves. Delete the first blue Gorka component outfit and save this outfit in slot 18. Then quit the mission through your phone. You should have this outfit equipped, so now you can start the bookmarked mission again. Change the clothing to play a saved outfit, invite someone and start. Now switch your outfit twice to the right again and ready up. When you load in, make your way over to your apartment and go to your wardrobe. Delete the blue Gorka component outfits and receive this outfit in slot 18, then leave the mission. Now go back to the clothing store and equip the blue biker suit again. Then start the clothing merch job, change the clothing to play safe outfits, invite someone and start. Switch your outfit three times to the right and ready up. Then go to the wardrobe inside your apartment. Delete the baby blue outfits and save this outfit in slot 17, then quit the mission. You can now equip the baby blue outfit. Now we will go back to the clothing store, then to Gorka suits and purchase the Cyan Camo Gorka suit. Then start the bookmarked mission. Change the clothing to play safe outfits, invite someone and start. Now switch your outfit once to the right and ready up. Then go to your apartment and go to the wardrobe.
Now go to accessories, gloves and select the race suit gloves. Delete the first blue bodysuit component outfit and save this outfit in slot 16. Then quit the mission through your phone. You should have this outfit equipped, so now you will need to start the bookmarked mission one last time. Change the clothing to player saved outfits, invite someone and start. Now switch your outfit twice to the right and ready up. Then go to your apartment and go to the wardrobe. Delete the blue bodysuit component outfits and receive this outfit in slot 16. Now leave the mission. We now made all the blue modded outfits. You can make them even better by adding helmets, masks and glasses. You can do that with the telescope glitch. A lot of people always ask me how to get the bodysuit mask, so I will show it right now. First go to the clothing store, then to arena war outfits, bodysuits and purchase the blue hero bodysuit. Now for some reason on outfits with a bodysuit part you won't be able to access accessories. So we will first have to equip an outfit that can have accessories. I will equip this helmet and then do the telescope glitch. So run by a telescope and spam right on your d-pad. Your character should not look into the telescope. Then equip the modded outfit, walk away and the helmet will transfer onto your outfit. Now resave this outfit. Then equip the blue bodysuit and do the telescope glitch again. This is what it looks like and you can do this for all 4 outfits. Let me know which blue outfit is your favorite. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.